It is the week of God. It is the week of God, so I'm going to keep climbing. All right, I'm going to keep climbing. The floor of death has come to an end. Easily my favorite Arkham Tower of God so far. Easily my favorite Arkham Tower of God. And it just seems like more insanity is coming our way with the hidden floor. So I'm... I'm yeah, I'm, as always, I'm not ready. As always, I'm not ready. Play Shadowverse so I can farm channel points. How would that help you farm channel points? Y'all should just hold on to your channel points, honestly, because I might be making some custom uh, things that you can get for redeeming those in the near future. So you might want to just save your channel points. You feel me? Uh, you might want to save your channel points. Um... You remember to start recording? I never forget to record. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. Um, Y'all hoarding channel points already. Shit crazy. TOG gets better with every arc. That's been the trend. That has been the trend. But anyway, at this point, me sitting here on stream and recording this vlog, if you're watching on YouTube, I don't know what kind of video you're getting right now. It may be such that I, I edit two different VODs together from today's stream and tomorrow's stream and just put the entire... Because I've heard this arc that we're getting into right now is only four chapters. So I kind of want that to be in one video. So you might be getting a combination of two different streams and two different VODs. And now that I think about it, that means my clothes probably will change mid-video. But whatever. You'll you'll know when you get it. Either you get the this by itself or you get... Some combination. It doesn't fucking matter. The point is, we out here climbing. That's all that matters. So smash that like button if you're hyped for the climb to continue. And we're just going to dive straight into it because I want to see. I, I genuinely want to see. I got 40 minutes. I genuinely want to see how far I can get in these next 40 minutes. So we going to dive in, man. We going to dive in. I want, I'm curious to see what this next arc is called. But I'm still, I'm still shook from everything I just read. And, like, if you combine that... Like, imagine what it must feel like to read the entire... I can't wait to do a reread. Because to read the entire Floor of Death in one sitting must be, like, one of the most tremendous reading experiences that this series has to offer, bro. It's kind of wild. It's kind of wild. But even just that, like, I shouldn't have expected any less that an arc of such a high caliber wouldn't, wouldn't end with a bang. You know what I'm saying? I should have known better. Should have known better. Um, anyway, one hour after, one hour after leaving the floor of death, what in the air above the floor of death, you met Iwa and Dunhua and, and, and Danhua, that's fucking swordsman's name. Psh, look at that smile on his face though. I, I didn't even remember his name. I'm not going to lie to you. I didn't remember your, your house number one only fans. I don't know. I just call him that or Mr. Swordsman, but whatever. On board the Wolhike Song submarine. That's right. I guess right now they're climbing the tower to catch up to you guys. What a relief, Coom. Totally. But what about Rock? Now, bam. You know as well as I do if Iwa and OnlyFans are alive. Rock Wraith Riser is most certainly alive. Come on now. Come on now. Yeah, now the perfect time to spam those Ewa emotes, by the way, if you've got access to them. Now the perfect time to spam those Ewa uh, emotes. But what about Rock? Wasn't there someone who looks like an alligator with them? I couldn't find him. After listening to what you had to say, I even tried looking for him once more. But when I tried to rescue them, there were just the two of them there. No. Don't worry, Bam. There's no way the alligator would be dead if those two are still alive. Thank you, Kuhn. Thank you. Thank you. That's just the logical fucking conclusion. There's no fucking way Iraq is dead and Iwa and Swordsman are alive. Let's not trip. Let's relax ourselves. Coon's just trying to comfort Bam. He might be. He might just be. I mean, look at the little sweat droplet on his face. He's just being optimistic to just soothe Bam's mentality. He's been saying that from the jump, though. Doesn't matter. He's right. That's all that matters. He's right. Yeah. Anyway. Now, getting to the main point. 
wife and Kuhn can't even lie to himself. You know, Kuhn. If if Kuhn really found out, like one hundred percent confirmed, Rock is dead. He feels some type of way about it, man. He he can act however he wants to. You know, it would bother Kuhn if Rock died. You know, it would bother. Him. Now, getting to the main point. Why Fug gave the thorn to you, and how they had a liquid that could separate the Red Threesha and Joe. And like, I'd like to ask you about these two things. Considering the fact that Gautam and Gustang had been watching you, plus the stuff that they told me, I have a basic idea of what's going on. But are you from the outside? It's time to let Big Bro Rick know what's going on, my guy. New Power is the name of this mini arc. Okay. Interesting. I, since it's Udek, it may be okay. Bro, you're joining Wool Hike Song anyway. You might as well let him know the information. You gotta trust this man. It's just as you said, Udek. Bam. I came from outside the tower. But I'm not really sure where I came from, since I was almost always underground from the moment that I was born in that place. So even if you ask me ask about the outside, I have almost nothing to tell you. I only heard about my parents after coming here. I also found out that Jihad is my parents' sworn enemy. So, you're from outside the tower too. If only Bam hadn't used his one free request from the last arc on that snake, he could have learned the whereabouts of Rock. But if Rock on the hidden floor and and Gaston can't actually go there or actually interact with it currently, then would he have been able to impart him that information? I wouldn't put it past him, but still. Bro! Bro! Tell me how this... <laughs> this is some JoJo shit right here, bro. This is some JoJo shit right here. Like It's not even subtle. This is not even so, this is some Dio shit right here, my guy. Like, I, it, it, it's not even, like, see you definitely meant to do this shit, too. Oh, my God. You dare approach me, bro. That's what... I have to, I have to save it just because of that, bro. I have to save it just because of that. Oh, my goodness. Don't mind any of this. The things that you've heard here. The things that you've seen here, the things that the people here want from you, don't pay attention to any of it. You are you. Don't ever lose yourself. Preach to your little brother, man. Preach to your little brother. That's powerful right there. That's what I've been trying to tell. That's what I've been trying to tell him, dude. That's what I've been trying to tell Bam, but obviously Bam can't hear me when I speak. What a legend. Right. So are you heading back to the train now? Yes, it's Evan and the others have already gone there. We had better hurry back. You know Yuri wants more information about this. Don't go picking on those babies too much just because they're cute. I don't want to get advice like that from a stalker. Ouch! Ouch! Damn. Well, I guess it's time to part ways now, bro. I can't even be sad that I'm that Urek is leaving because I got as 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 one of the top tier Urek stands, uh, self-proclaimed top tier Urek stands. I got more than enough Udek sh shine to sustain me for a, for a while. I'll be all right for a little while, dude. I can get through some arcs until I see Udek again. But that, I love this man so much, dude. Arlene Spaghetti, if you don't stop it. If you guys don't stop it. Um, this is time to part ways now. I'm a bit sad, but we'll see each other again someday. He w You will. Yeah, when you give him your answer about Wolike like song, that's what you need to do. Have a good trip, babies. Will it be okay to send them away like that? That boy is definitely... It's fine. Let's not hurry things. We'll meet him again someday in a higher place. Facts. 
but I feel like I'm forgetting something. Excuse me? Who the heck? No, 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 no. That, that doesn't bode well for me. That does not bode well for me. A hidden room on the hell train. What's this door? It's definitely different from the other doors on the train. It looks super suspicious. This is the same door that Karaka Bing appeared in front of. I don't know what's in there either. It won't open no matter what I do. Why did you bring us to such a suspicious place like that? Dude, Karaka says silence. Just be quiet for a moment. I didn't bring you all here to do anything here. I brought you here to use you as bait. What? I don't know why Vio's companion was with them, but you guys will definitely be useful. If you just do as I say, I'll spare your lives at least. That's your little brother that you that you handling like that, Karaka. That's your little that's a little brother that you that you handle like that, Karaka. He forgot Karaka, obviously. Well at that point I'll uh, I guess that's fair. Help me capture Veal, this bastard. Bet. Did Urek Mazino leave? Yes. That was incredible. I can't believe he saw the most powerful man in the tower in person. Say it again, Boro. Say it again for the fools in the back. All right? Yeah. Yeah. The what now? The most powerful man in the tower. Boro knows. Boro has good taste, dude. Boro, Boro, all right, bye. No one would believe us even if we told them. Yo, you should have got that autograph though, my guy. You'll get yourself captured. Oh, I'm tired. I'm going to head inside and rest now. And Dorsey's still thinking about what Garam said. I feel like I've become a bong bong driver. Yeah, you've been Ubering everybody around from this whole goddamn time. Boro likes and Dorsey and Rek, man of culture. That's facts. Sure, thanks for everything, and Dorsey. Yeah, she's still thinking about it. And Dorsey, never mind, you guys get some rest too. What was that all about? Don't worry about it. This isn't the first time that she's been like that. Well, I better go see Evan. Let's talk about the details later. Sure, thanks, Yuri. He talks like a sales. <laughs> all right, Ben. I don't know what you heard on the floor of death. But oh my god, I love her so much. That's what you need in your life, bro. That's a real big sis right there. She said, I don't know what you heard. I don't know what you what you got on your plate right now. I don't know what's going through your mind. But hang in there. I got your back. Where are her shoes? She, yeah, she never put the she never put the heels back on. You know what's funny is that when Endorsey was was making the metaphor to like Jahad's shoe collection when talking to Garam, they used Yuri's heel, heels for that though. Right, thank you, Yuri. Well, I'm going to go and get some rest now, too. I'll see you all in a bit. Hang in there, everyone. Ah, Kuhn, could I talk to you for a bit? What? The ma Oh, yeah, you didn't tell nothing about, told nobody about this yet. The master key to get into the hidden floor. Yeah, he said I could get in there if I use this master key. That's some really valuable information. I mean, it's the hidden floor. Plus, we can see Jihad when he was younger. Yeah, that's what I've heard so far, but I'm not sure where exactly I'm supposed to use this master key. It looks like Boron Sashi won't be able to tell us about this. Since their data would be erased, so I guess we'll just have to figure out how to use the master key ourselves. Maybe he would be able to tell us. Oh, good old Poe. Staff lodging on the train. What? The master key to the hidden floor? I had no idea such a thing existed. Are you serious? Yeah, it's right here. We thought you might know how to use it since you're the assistant to the chief engineer. Let's see, I'll have to look for the train manual. There's a manual for this? Of course there is! Well, I'm supposed to know it by heart, but I haven't really read it. You know, I can't fault him. Nobody really reads the fucking manuals, bro. Like, you just, you get a sense of it as you go. You ain't gotta read the whole goddamn manual. I can't fault you, Poe. I can't fault you, especially especially a manual for the hell train, dude. That shit gotta be thick. There's no way I'm reading that shit. 
Austin says he reads the manuals. I, bro, I don't read no manuals for nothing. Like, if I can't figure it out by trial and error, then it's not worth it. They made a master key which can access the data on the hidden floor in case, uh, in case a problem occurs. In order to use the master key, you have to get to the room of, the, of time past. The room is located as falls and can only be entered at 9 p.m. train time. In oh, that's the door that they've been in front of. In that room, there's a door which can be opened with the master key. But those with the data remaining on the hidden floor cannot enter because of a data clash. So they can only enter after erasing their data. And if you fail to find the exit after entering, you are stuck there forever. So be careful. The room of time passed. I don't think anyone ever told me about such a room. And it says the master key has been lost, so it can't be used right now. How did you find the key? So I have to start by finding the room. Or finding that room, yeah. Hey, shout out to Al Belda, dude. Kinda missed her. Hey, sleepyhead, you're already back. What did you do? How was the floor of death? Was there some kind of crazy battle? What happened? You could say all that. I slept, but of course Cherry Law didn't see none of it. I'm going to sleep some more. Ah, uh, okay. We've been traveling together for years, but I still don't understand that person. Alright, I'll deal with it as soon as I find them. Who the fuck she texting? Cherry. Cherry, please. Please don't fuck with me. Don't you fuck with me. I'm just going to remember that for now. I don't like that. That's shady as all hell. That's so fucking shady. The room of time passed. We're supposed to go all the way there. Have you noticed the two people Bam trust the most are Kuna and Rock? Of course I've noticed that. It's been a pair. It's been, it's been set in stone from jump, man. Still, at least we found out the location. Yeah, it's a good thing he's on our side. For now, let's keep the stuff about the hidden floor to ourselves, since we don't know whether Boro or Sachi will want to delete their data. Right. The next station is the last one, so we absolutely have to get there before then. We will be able to do it. Well, for now, let's give it a try. But bam, is your body okay? What? You got the second thorn, remember? I didn't even think about that. Well, it still doesn't really feel like it's mine. Probably hasn't fully integrated. Did you fully break the seal, though? There's also the promise that I made to Rachel. Plus, I feel sorry toward the people on the floor of death. I may have bought it with, brought it with me, but I still haven't tried it out. Got you. You better install that shit, dude, because it's about to take a toll on you. You might be incapacitated for some time like the first time. Wielding two of the thorn fragments at once. Can't be easy, even with all the progress you've made. Once Rachel wakes up, I want to use some kind of reasonable method to decide who really has the right to keep it. Shut the fuck! What are you talking about? What are you talking about? It's yours! Rachel, I... I'm sorry. I said I was going to rein it in. I said I was going to rein it in. <sighs> all right. All right. All right. Well, if it makes you feel better... Uh, by the way, since the battle with Joe ended, I've been able to do this. The fuck was what was that where did you get that shinsu i created a room behind that hallway over there since the battle my range that produces shinsu and my ability to judge or read situations have increased significantly just like the red three shit that's because that shit inside you look at this panel that's why I named the last... See, that for those of y'all don't, that don't understand where my mind is at sometimes, the only reason I named the VOD what I did for the one that went up today, uh, Lurking Demons, is because of the blue admin and the red Threesha that now reside inside this man. Shit broken. That's incredible. I managed to get my eyes back, but I'm not sure how to use this. See, this shit is not coincident. This is terrifying. For now, I'll have to get the remaining fragment of the red light from that woman. All this will be a mystery until I find that. A waterfall with three streams of water. Bam found the thorn fragment at that altar. Yeah, that's in the portrait too. But it's not quite done. Maybe that's what the waterfall is my... 
that maybe that's what the waterfall in my picture depicts. Then, maybe that picture isn't actually a picture of the thorn fragment that I saw, but rather contains a hint about the location of the thorn fragment that I'm going to find. Maybe the thorn is asking me to lead Bam to the other fragment. You might be on to something, Hockney. You might be on to something. That's right, I know. Uwek Masino may be a major variable, but the big picture hasn't changed. Excuse me, Gaston. Now, what is this big picture that you're referring to? The second Thor fragment has been delivered, and I also gave that pawn of yours a gift before coming here. That pawn, he says. Did he give Rachel some power? I can see something. He says that pawn of yours, and he says the the second fragment has been delivered. He probably, yo, he probably in league with Mircea, dude. He's probably in league with Mircea. That, that's the only thing that really makes sense at this point. Could be head on to, I guess he could. But that, the thing about the head on thing is that I don't really expressly think that and on like high manipulation on the on I don't know that that's just, that that's not a bad thought that's not a bad thought either. My first thought is Mircea though. Either way, it's 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 some crazy shit. It could be head on though. That's a good point. I don't know what this thing is. I can see something. Whether that power ends up being a disaster or a gift depends on those two themselves, and it somehow links these motherfuckers. All right, all right, all right, bet. Let's get one more chapter in. Let's get one more chapter. In. I'm gonna stop after this chapter because I only got 20 minutes and there's no way that, regardless of how long it takes me to get through this chapter, um, you know what I'm saying? That regardless of how long it takes me, there's no way I'm gonna be able to do another one after that. Arlene, I guess I shouldn't assume that Arlene no longer alive, but like that, that was my assumption, but she could still be lurking out here. I mean, like, Rachel R Rachel referred to her as, as how, like, she knew her, knew her. You know what I'm saying? Not even just that, like, she knew of her. The way Rachel brought up Arlene was, like, they had met before, but she's immortal. I thought only the, I thought, I, I thought, I thought V and, and her didn't get the immortality from the admin, though. Whatever. I don't know, man. I don't care. I actually don't care. Like, all of this speculation matters not because I, whatever answers I need, I'll get by climbing, bro. So, it, it, yeah, it really don't matter. Look on Twitter. I'm looking on Twitter. What's on Twitter? I'll see, I'll see nothing on Twitter that I haven't seen already. Unless I'm tripping. I already saw, I, I literally saw everything. What are you talking about, Ra? I saw these bald fucking. Oh, this Rachel. I don't like this. Why you gotta do this? Why you gotta do this? Why you gotta? Why you gotta do this? Is it cause I said that I that I like Umbreon? Is it cause I said that I like Umbreon? You gotta show me this. Is this the same artist that did the uh, the one with the Pikachu and Wang Nan though? Either way, I can't use this for nothing. That just ruins Umbreon for me. That just ruins Umbreon for me. Um, shit. Oh yeah, so I didn't show this during the vod. My bad. I guess I should. I guess I should show this. I showed it during the stream, but I didn't show this. Around. They be they be trolling me out here, guys. They be trolling me out here. Kiwi sent me with this. With this is an abomination. This is actually an abomination. This doesn't even need to exist. But I'm just gonna forget I ever saw it. But since I saw it, you have to see it too. All right. If I gotta see these cursed images, y'all need to see them too. So there was that one. Um, this one is even worse to me. Because y'all really taking this Udek bald spot thing way too far. You know damn well under that hat that is not what it looks like. You know damn well under that hat that's not what it looks like. <sighs> y'all crazy. Y'all are actually crazy.
anyway, back to what we were discussing before. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if Arlie was had the immortality. I I just didn't assume that. I just assumed that. But then, I don't. I just don't remember the timeline of the, of the backstory. Like I don't remember how Garb said it. Like, did Arlene and V flee after the floors were capped and and Jihad made the deal with the admin? I don't remember how like what the timeline of that was. But it does. Either way, it doesn't surprise me that she would be around. Um, as a matter of fact, I would assume that she would still be around just based off of Rachel's dialogue. Y'all yeah, say yes, but then. Prince says no after a baby was killed. Remember that Ar Oh, that's true. That's true. Yeah, Ar Arlene is immortal. Arlene, what Arlene does have immortality. V didn't though. V didn't though. That's what it was. Yeah, V didn't. V is the one. V alone just didn't have it. Um. Yeah, I could see, I could see her being around. Anyway, that's neither here nor there, bro. That's neither here nor there. What's this? I can see something. Did I change the? Uh, yeah. Okay. What is this thing, bro? It's gone. You're awake, Rachel. Oh my God. How are you feeling? Bam. So new power is referring to whatever the song in part, uh, in part. I mean, I guess it has dual meaning because it could be referring to the three shot as well and the, the second thorn fragment, but whatever. Meeting room on the train. What are you talking about? We just got back from the floor of death and now you want to go somewhere else. Yeah, that's just how things worked out. Anyway, Bam and I have decided to go. I'll give you guys a choice. We do need helpers. But I can't force you guys to put yourselves in danger. So where exactly are you going? Sorry, I can't tell you that. There's a certain condition. I'd appreciate it if you didn't ask anything. Because if I tell you where that place is, you'll forget about it. I know Sachi might just have an idea based off of that. I know that what I'm saying sounds ridiculous. But anyone who's willing to tag along even though it's dangerous and without asking anything. Gather in front of the sleeping car by 2 o'clock tomorrow afternoon. What do you mean? All right, I got it. Sachi. I think I get the gist of what he's saying. I knew it. Wait, so I'm the only one who doesn't get it, Boro? It's fine, man. Boro, Boro like, literally comic relief at this point, man. It's lit. Boro went from being, like, moderately, like, to the point where, like, I was like, Joaquin got a grudge against this man to, like, strictly comic relief. You find it odd that I'm not more mad that Rachel got a free power-up? I am mad. I'm just more curious about what it is than anything. That's the thing. I'm more mad that Gaston healed Rachel than I am that he imparted something on her because it's interesting. Right? It's for the same reason that the RDF and all y'all are always harping on about the writing of Rachel's character and the things surrounding her as far as the narrative. I find it interesting. So I want to, I'm more curious about what it is than the fact that she has it. But have you found a way to get there? Yeah, I think so. It looks like Sachi has figured it out. Then only those who want to go should gather by 2 p.m. tomorrow. Whoever's gathered in the hall at that time will go. Well, Cherry's definitely going because whatever Cherry's up to is probably tied to that. It's a man time. <laughs> Y'all tripping. You're a rule on the train. Hmm, I see. So you guys are going to the hidden floor on your own. Well, I'll let you go if you really have to. For now, I'll help you get. I'll help you get there since Karaka is on here too. You'll take me with you too, right? Well, we won't stop you if it's if you insist on coming because honestly, we need your help this time. Hwarun, you're going too, right? Sorry, I'll skip this time. I have some business of my own to attend to. What's up with her? She seems like she would even go to hell if it were for Bam. Does she know something about the hidden floor? Some good speculation, cool. For, don't we also need to get the ladle to Mararako so we can get the other fragment, bro? We actually about to gather up some fragments out here at this point. So where's Bam? He's meeting Rachel. Rachel. Rachel, why that bitch? I, and Dorsey? 
And Darcy, I don't know. I don't know either. I really don't fucking know either. But that's what we're doing now. Well, they've got a few things to talk about, like Hockney's picture. Bam seems like he's planning on taking her to the hidden floor. What? Why would he take her with him? Does he want to get stabbed in the back again? Still, we can't just leave her here. She's hiding a lot of secrets. Even if it's dangerous, we have to find out what she's hiding. So you want to go to the hidden floor, and whoever finds it first gets to keep the thorn. You do not need to give her this kind of fucking challenge. You, you do not need to give her this leeway, my guy. Yeah, I feel like we'll have to decide among ourselves who the owner of the second thorn fragment will be. Why are you giving me a chance like this? Why the fuck indeed? I don't get it either. Is it because I saved Kuhn or because you feel sorry for me? Don't kid yourself. I didn't do that because I wanted your pity. No, it's because we're enemies. We're enemies, so I thought we should make the competition fair. Bam, you're too, you're too nice, my guy. Fuck that. Fuck that. I mean, I respect it, but it's Rachel we're talking about here. It's fucking Rachel. She never played fair, so why do you have to extend the same courtesy? We have to get Hotney's picture back. Plus, there are some things that I want you to tell me about. So under those conditions, we're li well, you better just fucking win. That's all I can tell you. You better just fucking win. We're leaving tomorrow afternoon at 2 o'clock. If you come to the hall in front of the sleeping car, we'll leave together. Well, get lots of rest, Rachel. What the fuck? What? It was the little thing. It was the little thing that Gaston gave her, dude. It somehow scratched him while he was in there. What's this? Why am I bleeding? And it grew off of that. Did it absorb? Ah, uh, this is a fucking problem. This is a fucking problem, bro. This is a real fucking problem. Bam, and Dorsey. I heard you decide to talk to Ra uh, you decide to take Rachel to the hidden floor. And Dorsey, you see, yeah, how are you gonna explain this fucking shady ass activity to your girlfriend, my guy? You taking your ex well, I can't even call her that. We can't even really call her that. But for the sake of the metaphor, let's just call her that. You taking your ex to the hidden floor. And you meeting with her in back rooms and shit. Without Endorsey. What's wrong, dude? Endorsey, you see, I don't want to hear any excuses. How much longer do you te intend to defend that bitch? Thank you! Thank you. Thank you. I'm not defending her. She is... Uh, there's a lot of stuff that you want to find out from her. And you want to find that picture. Yeah, that's right, yo. She pissed. Fine, just wait a bit. I'll get the picture back and find out all the secret that she's hiding. And then you never talk to that dirty snake again. And Dorsey, what on earth are you planning on doing? Bam, are you more worried about Rachel's safety than mine right now? Aren't I a part of your team now too? And you see this with the whole, with the whole shit that Garam said to her that's weighing on her mind. Shit like this is going to lead and stress the relationship between Endorsey and Bam, dude. And I don't like that. I don't like that shit. No, it's not just an entanglement. No, stop that. Stop that. There is no just entangling with Rachel. You know, you don't, you... If you plan on letting Rachel join the team, you need my permission too, so don't try to stop me. Okay. Bro, I hope she doesn't get clipped by this new creature. You sure look a lot more relaxed than I thought, Rachel, even while being surrounded by people who resent you. And Dorsey. You. How much longer do you plan on clinging to Bam? You clingy ass bitch. Or she should have said. God damn. Much longer, I got. I got ten. All right, we, I gotta finish this chapter. Hold on, chat. I gotta ignore you guys for a second. Clinging. Who? I'm talking about you. You you say you can't stand them, and yet you keep hanging around him. 
You think this shit is funny? You find this funny? What are you laughing? Exactly. And Dorsey, are you jealous of me? Yeah. At least she admitted it. And that's fair, too. Because I don't understand. Like, I, I, I feel in Dorsey 100%. Like, what the fuck is Bam doing, bro? It couldn't be me. It could not be me. Y'all think, and, and then y'all want to say that I'm Sundare for, for Rachel. If I were bad, this bitch wouldn't even be in this room right now. I would have yeeted her ass. I would have never had the Stong healer. And, and Dorsey would 100% have the title as my girlfriend by this point. But no, nah, this motherfucker likes to fuck around. I'm surprised you being jealous of me. You should be. Because she's infinitely better than you. You already have a lot of stuff that I want in Dorsey. How could someone like you be jealous of me? This is such a strange feeling. And what exactly do I have? Beauty. Yo, she said it herself. She call, She's indirectly calling herself ugly. She's indirectly calling herself ugly. She said beauty. Power. Plus you're a princess, like a heroine in a fairy tale. So if you translate this by the inverse property, I'm ugly. I'm weak. I'm the furthest thing from a princess. I just wish I had been born like that too. Rachel is beautiful. You guys are delusional. Some of you guys, like I know like half of you trolling, but some of you guys really believe what you're saying and you are out of your mind. You're delusional. If you think Rachel is beautiful, there is something not quite right up here. Not quite right. We both had somebody's blood on our hands to climb the tower, but I'm a nasty bitch. She's saying it herself. RDF, please, by all means, by all means, try and defend this shit. And you go, I know how they're going to spin it. They're going to be like, oh, but the, re the remorse, and she recognizes the story about herself, and she's trying to, no, shut the fuck up. She's trash. And you're a beautiful, cool-headed princess. She ain't saying nothing but facts. Rachel says facts sometimes, dude. She, she spits facts sometimes. Not gonna lie. And you're forgiven for everything. Isn't that right? I am mean, Kiwi? I am mean for hating somebody that should be hated? How? How is this the perspective that people have about this person? I don't get it. I just don't understand. I really don't understand. I'm not bullying anybody. I'm not bullying nobody. Everything I say about her, she brought upon herself. That's a fair point. Those who say Rachel is a cling, Rachel is the one that jumped to the hobby, screaming and crying out that I'm the main character of this story. Okay, I'm done. I'm done. Look, I'm cool. I'm cool. I'm not listening to this chat. I'm finishing the chapter. I'm going to stop hating on Rachel, okay? My bad. I'm going to fall back. 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 I'm going to rein it in. And, you forgive, and you're forgiven for everything. Isn't that right? Uh, it must be nice. Being pretty, I mean. I would love you too if I were Bam. I can't understand why Bam follows someone like me around, you know. That bothers you too, doesn't it? You really are beyond help. Oh, shit. She said, catch me outside. And does he say, yo, bring your ass outside. Come outside, bruh. Let's go. I'll fix that warped personality of yours for you. Why here? I put a password on this place. Now, no one can get in here. The only problem, the only thing that scares me right now is that that new power that Rachel has might be a problem. I was wondering if you could try a simple test now. Here. Prove your skills to me now. I'll judge what kind of abilities you have that got you this far. There's nobody around her. There's nobody here in Dorsey. And even if she does anything, it's going to be thanks to what Gustav bequeathed her and not by her own power and, and ability. The only reason she is where she is is because she stepped upon other people to get here. And whether you deserve to follow us to the hidden floor. What do you mean? Didn't you hear me? If you can beat me here, I won't have any problems with in including you on our team. That's it. Are you kidding me? You're a princess of jihad. How could I beat you? You just want to take your anger out on me. 
This test is completely unfair. Shut up. Ooh, I love this. I love this. Unfair. Do you think there are rules like that when it comes to climbing the tower? Is there a rule that enemies should go easy on you just because you're weaker than me? I love you, Endorsey. I love you so much. Hold on, what did I... How did I... Oh, I know what I did. Hold on. Oh my god, you guys are delusional. You guys are delusional. I, I need you guys to be honest with me, bro. Because I'm really starting to feel like I'm losing my mind. I'm really starting to feel like I'm losing my mind. How much of you are actually trolling and how much of you really believe what you're saying about Rachel? Because those of you that genuinely believe some of the things that you're saying about Rachel, if that, shit is, that shit is problematic, dude. That shit is problematic. If you think she'd be... It's fine. It's fine. Stop whining and prove yourself to me here. Or just stop prowling about here and get the hell out of the tower. Ooh, I felt that. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Terrible. You plan on coming with us with those skills. Your presence would only be a hindrance, let alone help. It looks to me like you're the one who's gotten far more than you deserve compared to your abilities or effort. Not me. Preach to her by standing and manipulating others. You got to where you are. And then you have the audacity to be like, let me get a handicap. Shut the fuck up. Don't be ridiculous. I I knew this would happen. Oh, my God. This is about to be a problem. Bam. Hockney. What are you doing here? Are you here because of the picture? Sort of. The closer I get, the worse I feel about this. You have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, I'm not completely sure, but I can see someone near death around. Bro, do not play with me. What? If in do No, 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 no. I'm not having this. I am not having this. What's this? Something is not right. I don't see anything, but it never hurts to be careful. Bro, this, she has a whole ass stand now. Like, for real, for real, she got a whole ass stand. What? What was that just now, bro? I, I don't like how Hockney said somebody near death, bro. And Dorsey not dying. And Dorsey not dying. And Rachel got too much plot armor to die at this point. So who's dying, Hockney? Because that's not happening. I'm not, I'm not abiding by that. Shit. This is a cliffhanger and I, and I have to end on. I don't know. If you're watching this on YouTube, I don't know. You'll know, you know what I'm saying, by the length of the video, if you get more than what I, what I had. I'm honestly thinking that this this VOD is the VOD, and I'm just going to have the next two chapters tomorrow. I think that's going to be the plan. But don't fuck with me, and Dorsey not going out here. She's not going out here. Not like this. I can't, I can't, I can't, no, I won't allow that. I, I won't allow that. I'm not even going to think about it. I'm not listening to you. I'm not looking at chat. I will catch you guys tomorrow for it. We'll figure that shit out then. But smash that like button, all that good shit. I'm out. Peace.